All right, guys. I think we're ready for our guest to arrive. Yeesh! Yo, this dinner is sick. But you sure inviting a bunch of people that you hate tonight is a good idea? <sighs> Ricky, you have nothing to worry about. If any fight breaks out, Jay and I got it. Uh, cool. Just take care of it outside, because I'm not trying to break anything. You feel me? Yeah, sure, Cody. Me name's Wardrobe Cooking, and I'm going to expose people. How the hell did we get stuck with this? We are dumb. Wait. Wise man. Oh, yes, my tribal chief. Why is there an empty seat next to you? Well, that's odd. I don't think I missed anyone on the list. This is Tom Tucker with some breaking news. NASA has made the alarming announcement that the newly discovered black hole at the edge of our solar system appears to be expanding. Neptune and Pluto have already been consumed and the event horizon will reach Earth by tomorrow. That's right, Tom, which means that all life on Earth will be destroyed within 24 hours. <gasps> what? Mom is... Is this for real? I, I gotta finish my story. The end of the world. Holy crap! <laughs> Why does this keep happening to me? Wise man, fix this. Right away, my tribal chief. Call Adam Pierce. We'll be right back to the show on Disney Channel. This is the end. What? Oh my god, what happened? Well, it's become clear. The only way to avert this disaster is by writing a strongly worded letter to the black hole. Dear Space. Well, you're just full of surprises, aren't you? You think you're so good because you went to Chote. Well, you're not going to be so tough when I put a fishbowl on my head and a rocket pack on my back and come up there and punch you. Take that, Orion! That's right. All you are is a failed production company. That idea may just be crazy enough to get us all killed! Who else but Quagmire? It's just so hard to leave, even for one night. I beg to differ. I mean, just look at this place. It's disgusting. Okay. So, Rallo, go throw the dog food out. We have no use for it now. That'll make room for a new recycling bin in the kitchen. Hooray! Hooray for the Browns and Tubbses! Look, since these are our final hours, I want you kids to know how much your father and I love you and how important this family is to us. Oh, I'm scared. I wonder what it's like to die. I don't know. But from the look in the stray cat's eyes when you're pushing on its windpipe, I think it's pretty terrifying. Like... Panicky. Hey, Brian, what do you think is going to happen? What was that? You were praying. Come on, no, I wasn't. Yes, you were. You were praying, I saw. Oh, man, it was a joke. You were praying. There was a goof. I was goofing on you. You're, you're, you're disingenuous. I just saw MGM. What do you mean, MGM? He came round the... Hello, everybody. This is Montecor. He's my lion. I have a lion now. Hey, now, what the hell? <laughs> Jay, we're officially homeless. Yo, The Rock, do I not have a say in this? Lois, a day ago I was stuck on jury duty. Today I have a golden ticket to do whatever the hell I want. I feel like an old guy who's reliving his youthful shenanigans. Tell me about when you were young, Grandpa. Oh, Sonny, those were crazy times. My friends and I were out of control. We used to give each other wet willies and funny arms. We'd play dandy balls and legs are spread and penis butt. Sounds kind of gay, Grandpa. It was gay. Everyone was. But back then, we were called pole fancies. It was real good old-fashioned grab the nearest tree and hold on for dear life gay. Not today's fancy featherbed thread count gay. People got hurt back then. That's gay. Yeah, it was pretty gay. Me video is done. Now time to post this. Chris, the way to eat an Oreo is to twist it, pull it apart, and lick it. Now you. Mommy's here? Dom, mommy, glad you can make it. Yo, how's it going, baby girl? Listen, Jay, don't even look in mommy's direction. Yo, is this the girl Jay's been talking about? Nah. He better not be talking about mommy, 
You keep her name out your mouth. <laughs> she wants me. No, she doesn't. She only wants me. Yo, is she talking about me? What's she saying? Don't worry about it, Jay. Let's go, Dum Dum. Hey, yo, Roman. I need to talk to you. What is it, Ricky? I'm busy. The new episode of Keeping Up with the Kardashians is on. Listen, I know we've been roommates for a few months now, but it ain't working out. You need to leave. Leave? As in get out? Are you trying to evict your tribal chief? Yeah, you ain't welcome here no more. What the hell are you doing with a musket? Last day on Earth? I've always wanted to save a Native American family from rapacious cavalrymen. Yeah, this one will do nicely. Let her go. You don't have to be afraid of him anymore. Forget the bar! Later. Stay with us as the countdown to Doomsday continues with just six more hours to go. The only thing that's nice about this is even though it's a Tuesday, it feels kind of like it's a Friday. We now return to Tuesday Night Smackdown. Let me ask you, what is finishing the story? Peter, where are you going? Last day on Earth, last chance to do this. I'm going to find the black neighborhood and see what happens if I yell the you-know-what word. Meanwhile, back in the lowlands... Brian, don't! Oh, well, I hate Nick. Penis? No! Live on TBS. Blink, who's blink? I've got to get you five. Punk, he five. Oh. And now, back to the show on Disney Channel. They respected me for saying it. <sighs> well, ladies and gentlemen, this is it. Our final minutes. Any moment now, the Earth will be sucked into the gaping maw of the black hole. <gasps> you stay away from the head of the table! No! No, you better not come anywhere near here. You better know your role and sit anywhere else. I tried to warn you! Roman, come on, we can talk about this. D don't make any rash decisions right now. Wise man, handle it. Cody, sit down! Your tribal chief is trying to handle his business. Mom, where's Dad? I don't know, Chris. Sorry I'm late, guys. Peter, where have you been? Look, you try scheduling a haircut today. You know, you'd think you'd want to spend your last day on Earth with your family. Hey, I'm here, aren't I? With only seconds left. Don't you love me? Of course I love you, Lois. You're the most important person in the world to me. You promise? I promise. Underwater sunsets sure are beautiful, eh, Squidward? Yeah. Yeah. This is great. Just the three of us. You, me, and this brick wall you built between us. Yeah. <laughs> Sunsets always remind me of bowls of fruit. What do they make you think of, Squidward? Ah! Explosion. Nah, this fool gotta be joking right now. But Jay's cooking food. He can't leave. Well, allow me to discuss this with your tribal chief. <laughs> Here it is! 10, 9, 8. I just hate being around the kids. What? What? Oh my god! 5. Sorry, I just thought I'd be honest since we're gonna die. 4. 3, 2, 1. 1. April Fools! What? You've gotta be kidding me. You're not gonna die? No, we're not gonna die. Oh my god! Hey, yo, is that The Rock? What the fuck was that? Wait, what did Dad just say? No! I'm sorry. Don't no! Goodbye. Hello, we got you our beet salad.
Well, you can't beat Beats. Beats, they'll make you pee red. It's not blood. What? Again? That was so random. Now someone is copying the more gar 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 go go more more gar 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 go we go we. Daddy, and another scrub is copying the more gar go we. I swear. What? that. What is all the potty words that I am hearing? That's it. You're no longer a phase. What a nut!